Hello, this is Metroid Fighter. <sighs> really it is. Am I? I don't know. Anyways, this is my tutorial on how to install wire, wire extras, and... Phoenix Storms Muddle Pack. <laughs> yes, for Gary's Mod. Right. This is for Tech Members Only, or Team Echo. This is for our little server. If you've if you're anyone else and you've come here to become enlightened with my intelligence, you're going to be disappointed. But I will give you information on how to get SVN or to install SVN to use to get other SVN files or information from the internet where you can play your games with mods and other little nifty things. I'm not going into that. Now, we opened up uh, my little explorer program and we go to download but first this is tortoise svn's website it's tortoise svn.net i will have that in the links up there over here now you go to download and once you click download now see here could be a problem do you have a 32-bit or 64-bit operating system? If you do not know, I will enlighten you. Go to your start bar, then go to your computer. Now, from here, you can go to your control panel. There is easier ways, but I'm just technical. And by the easier way, you can do start bar or control panel. See? I'm just an ass. Anyways, go to system. When you open system, you should see system type. 64-bit operating system. Oh. I have a 64. Yours might be a 32-bit. I really don't care. And we close this out. Pick the <gasps> bit that is yours. Mine's 64 bit, so I would click the link. And then we wait a second. And we wait another second. Oh, there it is. And then we would save the file. But since I already have it, I'm closing it out. You save. I'm canceling out. You save. Cancel. You save. Now, I'm going to close this out. And then we're going to go to downloads. That's where normally in Vista, not certain about XP, but in Vista, it goes boop. And we go there. Let's see, I already have mine linked, but you can go to Documents, and go into the folders, and then you shrink that, and you go to Downloads, and then you get whatever version works with your system. Mine 64-bit. If you use 64-bit in a 32-bit, it will not work, surprisingly. If you have a 32-bit, try to use 64, will not work. If you have a 64-bit and use 32-bit, it will not work. Hmm. Could it be a compatibility issue? I don't know. I will click the 64. And I will run it. And then I will click next. But see, there's going to be a problem. I've already installed this. You do know how to click next, don't you? Click next, then click next, click next, click next, click next, until you see an installing bar. Then it will finish and will tell you to <gasps> restart your computer. Yes, restart your computer. Uh, you might want to bookmark this or put it in your favorites. <laughs> or maybe you would like to subscribe. Anyways, bookmark it where you can come back. I will see you then if you do not get the blue screen of death or hard drive failure. Works for me though. Maybe not so much for you. Okay.